Tissue culture, also known as micropropagation, is a brand new technology that uses power to divide and grow cells from just one mother cell. This technique is commonly used in agriculture and medicine. For today, the main and the most efficient way to develop an enormous amount of this plant culture is to use this technique. So, just why not? Who would not love having a self-cultured orchid sitting at home, right? Let's dig into it. Required technique for this experiment is not really a lot. You will just need a multiplication medium, autoclave, but pressure cooker works just fine. Just to put this medium, sterile box which is highly required because even the one contaminant is enough to fill this whole process. Also basic lab equipment such as lancet and tweezers and the plants that you're gonna work to. Personally, for this experiment, I use the Palnopsis orchid. pH meter is also highly required because you're gonna need to measure the pH level of your medium. If pH level is too low, your medium isn't gonna get solid. For sterilization, you will need ethyl alcohol and bleach. Please keep in mind that if you're not capable of providing a sterile environment, doing this experiment is just waste of time, money, and energy. So, first, we're gonna cut off the stems of orchid. Please make sure that buds on stem are not already spent, because it is buds that is gonna produce a new plant. Wipe down everything with ethyl alcohol and bleach. Because if any contaminant occurs in growth medium, stems will not grow. Prokaryotics divide much faster than eukaryotics. Cut them the way to keep one singular bud on one cutting. If you're working at home just like me, I recommend having more than one cutting. Because even if you're trying to reduce the risk of contamination, one of them will definitely get contaminated. You just can't produce fully sterile environment at home. So for now, we're gonna put these cuttings in 10% solution of bleach. Peel off the cover of bud, but be careful, because you don't really want to damage it. We're doing this because the bud cover may carry some bacteria. Let's keep bacterial colonies for another video. Now put them into a bleach solution, but don't use the bleach solution that you used before. Cut off the ends of stem, because the end parts of stem are already dead, because it was in direct contact to bleach. Now put those cuttings into the ionized or dehydrated water. Excellent are full of bleach, so we need to get this bleach out of plants.
Measure the medium according to your needs and put it into a jar that you're gonna sterilize with autoclave or pressure cooker. Proper sterilization is accomplished by autoclave, but as I am too poor to buy a couple of thousand dollars cost autoclave, I'll just use household friendly friendly pressure cooker. Right after sterilization, take medium out. Don't wait it to get cold. It will get solid and it will not be able to pour into another jars. Now put medium into separate jars. 